All right, guys, welcome back for another GMRS slash RF coax educational moment. All right, so here's the deal. I get this all the time. People tell me that my SWR is 1.1, 1.0. And they tell me they are transmitting at 50 watts. Their meter is here, and they have 100 foot of coax. Now remember, if you have three decibels of loss in 100 feet, that means by the time you get to the antenna, you have 25 watts at the antenna. But SWR is reflected wattage. So what happens is wattage goes from here all the way down, and you get 25 watts here. But if you have a bad SWR and it's reflecting 10 watts back, well, you're only getting five watts of reflective power here, right? So your meter is reading five watts, but the reality is 10 watts is your reflective power. So you're not gonna have a true SWR unless you eliminate the coax in between and put a short jumper between the meter and your antenna. That's the only way to get a good true SWR. 